All right, what's going on everybody? So quick video tutorial, right? I'm gonna show you how to put your DualSense controller in pairing mode so you can connect to your PC or other devices through Bluetooth, right? It's real simple. This used to be the share button, now it's the create button. You hold the create button and the PlayStation Home button, and of course my cat has to make a cameo, uh, you hold the create the create button and the uh, PlayStation Home button at the same time. Hold it, and then you're gonna see the controller touchpad start blinking. Yep, see it's blinking. That means it's in pairing mode. Then what you do on your PC, and obviously you have to have a uh, PC or a laptop with um, Bluetooth enabled, whether that's through an adapter or it, it's, it comes natively in your uh, PC, you gotta have either one, then you just go to your Bluetooth settings, which I'm gonna do now. Okay, so now on your PC, you could just type in Bluetooth in the, uh, in the search bar. And let me just put my controller back in pairing mode so it can actually detect it. Hit add Bluetooth device, add a device, hit Bluetooth, and you'll see the wireless controller input. And there you have it, it's good to go. You can obviously connect it directly through USB, um, USB-C, it'll do the same thing. And to just test it out to make sure the controller is at least being detected, you could just type in controller and uh, set up USB game controller, go to advanced, actually properties and then when you hit the buttons you should see the inputs being read so that's how you know uh, it's actually being detected here's the thing though not all games seem to be picking up the controller the PC is picking up the controller right now through the inputs but that doesn't mean that all games are going to pick up the inputs and, and read it so far I think I've heard like Dragon Ball Fighters works with it uh, Destiny 2 works with it, but a lot of the main games I've played don't seem to pick it up. So they might need to, I don't know, drop a, a, a driver so, so all games support it, um, you know, or, you know, there may be uh, some type of update that's needed so you can use it across all games on Steam and everything like that. So yeah, but that's pretty much how you pair it through Bluetooth. All right, that's it. Let me know what y'all think. Hit the like button. Appreciate y'all. I'll catch y'all on the next video. All right. Peace.